Hello, I'm Kimon Francis. Mona High School in St. Andrew is set to remain closed tomorrow amid ongoing violence among students of several corporate area schools. It is understood that the violence escalated following an incident on Monday in Halfway Tree in St. Andrew. Strike action by correctional officers at the Horizon Adult Remand Center this morning forced an adjournment of the Klansman gang matter in the Home Circuit Court until July 11. A planned protest at Stairton Academy in St. Anne in support of dismissed principal Sharon Mangal failed to materialize today as parents stayed away. Mangal was dismissed by the school board on Tuesday after a disciplinary hearing into a Caribbean Examination Council CXE fraud at the school in 2022. A former Jamaican ambassador says the diplomatic corps is likely to be disturbed by the dishonoring of two former prime ministers in a controversial post that appeared on the Instagram page of State Minister in the Ministry of Foreign Affairs, Alanda Terrellong. Ambassador Curtis Ward said the State Minister dishonored former prime ministers Portia Simpson Miller and PJ Patterson when his job was to represent the entire country. In sports, FIFA is said to create dozens of new committees and expert panels, reversing a governance reform passed in 2016 when the world football body was in turmoil during corruption scandals. In your currency trading today, one US dollar was being sold for $156.57, the British pound is sterling for $193.61, and the Canadian dollar for $115.29. In your weather forecast on Friday morning, there will be partially cloudy skies across sections of eastern parishes. In the afternoon, expect isolated showers across northeastern parishes and sections of southern parishes, with windy conditions across sections of northern parishes. And that's it for the Gleaner Minute. Remember to follow us on X, formerly Twitter, Facebook and Instagram. And like, comment and share on YouTube. I'm Kimon Francis.